Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Let's see what is this Mercury retrograde bringing to you. What change is bringing to your life and what things are coming back to your life. So we have three piles, one, two and three. Take a pause if you need to choose one pile. So if you're ready, let's go with pile number one. Hey, pile number one. So let's see, what is this Mercury retrograde? bringing to you guys so the main focus for you guys will be ace of cups it will be influenced by six of pentacles your base energy here will be knight of wands we have seven of pentacles as your past position your mental process will be knight of cups Okay, let's put you here okay so what change is bringing this retrograde we have princess of swords we have also defeat or five of swords as your subconscious area your advice is nine of uh, wands future influence is princess of cups and the outcome we have eight of pentacles. So I'm seeing here that you guys will be dealing with some sort of... You'll be dealing a lot with emotions, right? So for some people this uh, Mercury retrograde uh, brings maybe certain situations, certain people back. But you guys, you're dealing with some aspect of your childhood here, it seems. With this six of pentacles energy and it will be revolving around your feelings and emotions around your childhood this could be also connected with your mother so some aspect of this will be um, happening here so you, your energy here is a knight of wands so this is like this fiery passionate energy right so and also here with knight of cups it's interesting, you have two knights and two princesses, right? Um, so the thing is that you might be dealing with implementing some sort of a change or uh, there is maybe some kind of um, igniting old passions, right? So something that you liked doing when you were a child or maybe this is connected with uh, something that you loved doing but you have stopped but you are restarting it again right and i'm feeling this is something you have already done in the past right so if this is maybe job related or maybe with work related or maybe some aspect of that it's showing that you'll be uh, restarting this whatever this was right with this pentacle energy I also see here you are gaining new ideas on how to restart this project, how to restart, how to improve it, um, how to upgrade it, right? Because this is something that you are passionate about, it seems, and it brings you a lot of emotional satisfaction, right? Uh, so you are afraid or you will be dealing with maybe fears of abandonment or maybe you will be fearing maybe some kind of loss or that you will have to leave this situation behind with this five of swords here uh, Usually five of swords is also talking about um, The soldier is He gained victory, but for a high price, right? So Maybe you are afraid that you will be exhausted by this or that maybe this uh, situation here will bring you some sort of um, great deal of troubles, right? But this is just your fear, right? But your advice here is go for it. Uh, invest the work, invest yourself and invest your emotions into this uh, situation, whatever this is. Let's try to get more clues on what this actually is. Let me find my other pile of cards where is it okay it's here so let's see what is this connected to we have leader okay it says um 
regain leadership in this position. So this is something that you might be dealing with. And we have light and love. Your life, um, how would I say this? How would I translate this? Okay. I see also the retrograde is also affecting my ability to speak. <laughs> So yeah, your goal in life is to um, be a divine healing light in this world, right? And showing your love. So what else? Let's see. And learning. So maybe you are restarting to learn. So we have leadership, we have guidance and love. I mean love and light. And learning something. So you are learning about something that you love doing, right? And this might be connected with some sort of higher position here or with maybe a leader position. So you will be restarting something, right? So maybe this is a class or something that will enable you to become, to come to a higher level, level of maybe profession, right? So this is connected to this. And yeah, it's saying invest your effort into this because it will be really worth it, right? Um, you will be really emotionally satisfied by this. So, and as a result of this uh, retrograde here for you guys, I'm seeing a lot of work. So there will be a lot of work for you guys. You will be really working diligently. Um, so if you are, if this is connected to some clients, maybe, or income of money, it's saying that you will have a lot of work to do, right? Okay guys, so this was your message for this retrograde, what to expect. Thank you for watching. See you next time. Hi, pile number two. So let's see what is this Mercury retrograde bringing you guys. What kind of change? So your main focus will be Queen of Pentacles. The Sun, your base energy will be Page of Wands. Your past position here is Two of Wands. Your mental position is Nine of Pentacles. A future position here is King of Swords. Subconscious area, let's see. Is Death and Rebirth. Rebirth. Your advice card here is King of Pentacles. Your future influence is Eight of Swords. And the outcome is Four of Cups. Okay, so let's see what is this about. So yeah, with this I'm seeing a lot of individual energy. So I'm getting that uh, one thing that you will be dealing is your freedom, your uh, individual energy, and it's mostly based around you, your personality, who you are, your status, how do you conduct yourself, um, how important you are with this Queen of Pentacles and the Sun energy. And with this yeah, Knight of Pentacles, you are concentrated on yourself with this... Um, Mercury retrograde and you are gaining or you are trying to achieve some sort of financial success here it seems and this is some this is something that you have ignited this idea also with this past position here too of wands this is something that you have planned maybe this was some time ago when you planned this but uh, now it's starting to happen here so this was your vision, your plan, your wish, and it's connected with your financial status, with your finance, with your career. You might start to work on your own projects here with this page of wands. And with this King of Swords energy, I'm seeing that you want to be your own boss. You want to feel mentally that you are in control over yourself here. You don't want to be tied to somebody else, to some organization or some company, right? You want to work for yourself. You need this individual energy here. So this is something that you will be dealing with, right? Um, this could can be a bit scary to follow your path, right? To be your own boss. So this 
seems to be a bit scary for you guys. But this is saying that don't be afraid because your advice here is King of Pentacles. So this is saying that you need to ignite your more masculine side about this. So be brave, take action, go forward with it and don't worry about fear, right? You see here the wolves, so they are fearless, they, they're tactical, they, you know, they uh, take time to find their prey. This prey in this uh, situation is your goal, right? So be patient and just go with it. You want to achieve this status. Um, but let's see why is this Four of Cups here as an um, outcome. We have the Devil Energy and Strength. So yeah, you lack maybe patience. You maybe lack or maybe you lose interest if the things doesn't bring results right away, right? So this is your challenge here in this uh, Mercury retrograde to stay focused on your goal and just try to be persistent, right? Try to perceive, don't give up um, because it seems that you lose hope quickly, right? You lose interest because there is no results that come quickly, right? Um, but your, uh, your, how would I say, um, your challenge here is to be persistent and don't give up. So this is your main message here. Let's see what is this connected to. We have heart's desire, so this is something that you are desiring. And diet, so this might be connected somehow with food or maybe healthy lifestyle or lifestyle in general. And you're on the right path, see? So you just have to be persistent, right? If this diet thing doesn't uh, resonate with you guys, maybe this is thing that you need to take care of eating healthy, right? In this period, so... Okay, guys, this was your messages for this Mercury Retrograde. Uh, wish you lots of luck, thank you for watching, and I will see you next time. Hello, pile number three. So let's see what is this Mercury Retrograde bringing you guys. Let's see. So your main focus here, we have Ten of, ten of Swords. Influence here is Seven of Wands. We have a Wheel of Fortune as your foundation. Best position was Temperance. Your mental energy is Six of Cups. Your future position here is Queen of Cups. Subconscious area, we have Two of Cups. Your advice card, let's see, is Ace of Cups. You'll be, you'll be future influenced by Five of Pentacles, okay? And the outcome of this retrograde, Ace of Wands. So yeah, this, this combination here, it's saying that you'll be dealing with um, a subject of being tired right being exhausted and this is connected with work it seems this is connected with your uh, obligations with your responsibilities things that make you feel really tired right but there seems to be that you have gained some kind of uh, a lucky break here with this wheel of fortune so you have gained something that you were searching for and waiting for with this temperance card so you might be starting a new job you might be starting something new in this period and it seems that focus around this will be revolving around feeling tired so maybe you have always had jobs or situations that made you feel tired so this is something that it was always present right um, so your challenge I'm guessing here in this period will be how to change this how to find solution to this feeling really tired let's see what can you do Six of Swords and Six of Pentacles, interesting. And Page of Pentacles, okay, really interesting. So yeah, there is, this is talking about balance. So maybe when you are in a workplace that makes you feel tired, maybe you try to lead the things, you try to lead everything, right? Everything, all the burdens are 
you feel that you have you have to carry all of the burdens, right? And you have to carry all of the difficult work. But the Six of Pentacles is saying, no, you need to let other people also work, do their work, right? So don't be this person who needs, who feels that you need to deal with everything, right? So if this is working in a team, you tend to take responsibilities from other people, right? Instead of they having their own responsibilities. So this is something that you have to learn here in this Mercury retrograde. Um, your position here, your future position as a result will be Queen of Cups and you'll be influenced by Five of Pentacles. So uh, let's see what is this all about. King of Swords. So I'm getting that you will mentally be prepared, prepared to stick with this situation here, with this job maybe or this position. Because you don't want to be stuck in constantly losing money or losing jobs or changing jobs. You want to avoid poverty here, right? You want to have money. Um, and yeah, this is again talking about connections, right? There is some kind of subconscious blockage or fear connected with relationships. So this could be a job relationship or maybe a love relationship. But you tend to repeat the same pattern in all of your relationships, right? You tend to give too much and you receive too little, right? So this is the cause of your exhaustion, 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 <laughs> Mercury retrograde, right? So your job right now is to learn how to balance things out. So, you know, um, it's not your responsibility to always just give, 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 but you also need to take right and let others sometimes lead as a result there is a new energy here i'm seeing here this um you know this rays that are coming so this is, feels like energy so you will have more energy as a result so let's also see what is this connected to we have creative uh, expression okay we have also energy healing and spiritual leader so yeah you need to really um so this is about expression how you speak how you communicate how you give yourself to others right and this is saying that you really need to be conscious about how you spend your energy how much energy you give from yourself okay so you really need to be prepared mentally when you enter in this situation to breathe to calm yourself down and let yourself know it's not all your responsibility, right? Okay, guys, this was your short message for this Mercury Retrograde. Thank you for watching and listening. Uh, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.